Ah, by the way, if anyone is actually watching at home and wondering just what height difference there is between me and Samantha here, I think Samantha may have the answer. I ain't gonna tell ya, I know why. Oh, well. <clears throat> well, okay, the next award is for the best British male artist, and the nominations are dominated by established stars. Between them, they can log up over 80 years in the business. Mick, name the names. Phil Collins. George Michael. Robert Palmer. Chris Rea. Steve Winwood. Ah, yes indeed. A very clean sweep for singer-songwriters. I better start writing quick, I think. <laughs> to announce the winner, the two people have crafted their classics on their own, Joan Armour Trading and Joe Elliott. Good evening. Oi. You ready for this? Best British male is... Who else? Phil Collins. No need to put it too low. <clears throat> um, right, well, I mean, good company tonight. Uh, I, I really thought that George or Stevie might get this because they've had such a great year in America, but I'm very flattered to get this. Can I just say, just shush me, just, I'd just like to say um, that Anne Dudley is here tonight. Stand up, Anne. It's Anne Dudley. She co produced the groovy kind of love with me. And she's also responsible for the soundtrack. And I, I didn't see her before. <laughs> anyway, before I get off and let the proceedings carry on, I'd like to um, say thank you to Lamont Dozier, who co-wrote Two Hearts and Acapulco with me. Great thrill working with him. I'd also like to thank my manager, Tony Smith, who's been a tower of strength for 15 years. Hit and run music. I'd like to thank my, my family who I've never thanked publicly or privately, me mum and me brother and me sister, Clive and Carol, and also my dear lady wife, Jill, who, who lets me come to all these things and lets me do all the work, and in six weeks we'll give birth to a new generation of Collins. I just hope that he's a bit taller and he's got more hair, but thank you very much. <laughs>